While more Americans own homes than ever before, many don't realize there may be a better mortgage for them or that they could simply save a lot of money on the uh, current mortgage that they're paying on right now. Best-selling author David Bach believes that real estate is the easiest route to wealth, and he explains why in his newest book, The Automatic Millionaire homeowner and he's back for a second day David good to see you again good to be back thank you all right so now you have this plan that people can uh, pay off their mortgage early and save thousands in some cases hundreds of thousands of dollars hundreds of thousands of dollars this, this sounds too good to this be is true. called the automatic millionaire mortgage approach okay <laughs> here's what you do anybody's got a mortgage needs to stop what they're doing and listen right now okay. because I can sh I can save you tens of thousands of dollars if you've got a 30-year mortgage I don't want you to pay your mortgage for 30 years. Okay. I've got an approach that will get you out of debt in less than 23 years. Here's what you do. You take your mortgage payment. Let's say it's $1,000 a month. As a simple example, instead of paying it once a month, you pay half, $500, every two weeks. When you pay your mortgage this way, you make one extra payment a year, and you take a 30-year mortgage, and you shave it down to 23 years, saving seven years on your mortgage. Now, we have a great example here. Let's show this example of a $300,000 yeah, mortgage. Yeah, if you have a $300,000 mortgage. If you have a $300,000 mortgage at 7% interest, your payment would be $1,995. Okay. They don't change anything. It's just the way you pay it. $997 every two weeks. You will have that mortgage paid off in 23 years. Now, look at the savings here. The savings on that $300,000 mortgage is a hundred and six. Thousand dollars. That's great. That's real money. That's that is real money. Now, here's what this does for most people. Most people who pay their mortgage off early retire early mm -hmm. if they want to. It buys you freedom. Now, what's the trick to this? Couple things you need to know. There's a cost to do it. The banks will charge you anywhere from five to ten dollars on average a month. And is that what keeps some folks from doing it? That's what keeps a lot of folks from doing it. Now, here's the crazy thing. If you really look at the money over 23 years, it's going to cost you somewhere between a thousand to fifteen hundred dollars to do this. Okay. Basically, it's like a latte a month. But aren't okay. you saving a hundred and six thousand dollars? <laughs> You're saving a hundred and six thousand dollars. <laughs> now, if you don't want to pay the fee, there's a couple other approaches. You can make one extra payment a year, mm -hmm. but most people won't because when they get to the end of the year, they don't have the money or you can add an extra 10% a month towards your principal. But again, most people won't. Less than 3% of Americans prepay their mortgages. Uh, let, let me ask you this question. Um, do you have to stipulate that this additional money go toward the principal? You do, but when you do a biweekly mortgage, they do it for you automatically. And the other key is that most people are paid every two weeks. So this is a cash flow thing. It makes it easier to pay your mortgage. Also, you won't have late fees because they're taking the money automatically out of your checking account, they're applying mm -hmm. it to your mortgage, and they track this to make sure that it goes towards your principal. You're not changing your mortgage, you're just changing the way you pay your mortgage. We touched on this just a little bit uh, yesterday. You talked about your home as, as forced savings. I think a lot of people might say, well, this is a great idea if I'm going to be in this home for 30 years. What if right. you're not? Should you still do it? You absolutely should still do, still do it, and here's why. Most Americans stay in a home at least seven years. When you put money into that principal payment, when you pay those principal down, you're just building up your savings account. So when you sell your home, that equity goes with you to your next house and makes it easier to buy your second home. Mm -hmm. It's a great concept, and uh, anything that saves $106,000, uh, I'm all for. Yeah, that, you know, the Automatic Known Homework book was about giving people yeah. simple ideas that they can use quickly yeah. in less than a few minutes to change their life. You got it.